Okay, last box break uh, of this Tuesday afternoon would be for Prestige 1314. Uh, this is my first ever box of this product. Pretty uh, old product from a couple of seasons back. So, hoping to land at least one old school autograph because uh, in the Prestige uh, collection, there are quite a lot of old school player autographs. Gotten quite a few from the 15-16 uh, version. So let's see if I let's see if I can get lucky with this one as well. All right, pretty big on quantity. Eight cards in 24 packs. Quite a lot to open. Gotta make this quick. Uh, I believe there should be some uh, memorabilia cards as well. So, alright, let's go. Kyrie. Pretty cool to get some old season basketball hobby boxes every now and then so that you can get you can still get players like Kobe, Tim Duncan you know, players who have recently retired Kawhi Leonard Greek Freak, of course, uh, he was only a rookie back in 1314. This one looks pretty thick. Feels thick. Hickson, Solinger, Auto Porter. Okay, so it's just a dummy card. So there's value for money this product if you are looking to build up a base set. No sign of any hit cards yet. Two autographs per box and two memorabilia cards. That's what's advertised in the box no numbered hits yet also Maybe let's try from the other side well the inserts aren't really you know not really a standout product here I mean, the base cards are pretty simply designed. The inserts aren't that aesthetically pleasing to the eye, you know. Well, at least to me, it isn't. This one feels thick as well. Alright, so who's this? Alright, it's uh, Chris Paul. This is a memorabilia card. Pretty ordinary white patch. So nothing to shout off. Kevin Durant. Mr. Big Shot, Chauncey Phillips. And is this memorabilia numbered? I don't think so. Very ordinary looking right there. Come on, there are the autos. Rajan Rondo. 
Alright, this would be, I would think, an old school auto based on the jersey that he's wearing. Darrell Griffith. It almost has a Donruss soccer feel to it. But it's a pretty nice looking auto. Darrell Griffith. Alright, so he played for the Utah Jazz in the uh, early 90s. So most likely he's the he's a teammate of the uh, famous one two combo of John Stockton and Carl Malone. I'm not sure if he's a starter. But the Utah Jazz team of the 90s does pack a punch, especially when you have uh, quite arguably the best point guard as well as the mailman, Carl Malone. LeBron. So presumably this is the old school auto. Not really the uh, old school player that I was looking for, but nonetheless, pretty decent looking auto. But to be honest, uh, the Utah Jazz team of the 90s, I only know those two players. Not so familiar with the rest. So one more uh, auto hit, one more memorabilia hit. Kirk Heinrich, Clara Zhao. Taj Gibson, this is a pretty thick pack. It's just a dummy card again. Yeah, the inserts are really not nothing too much to shout about. Franchise favorites, Kyrie Irving, Clay Thompson. So I would think uh, if this were to be a mediocre box, most likely the other autograph hit would be a rookie auto. Of course, uh, I won't mind hitting uh, Giannis autograph. That would be cool. John Smith. Yeah, this is the autograph hit. Kelly Olinick. Had one monster game, I think, in the uh, Eastern Conference semifinals against, uh, I think it was the Washington Wizards. So that set the pace for the Boston Celtics to march on all the way to the Eastern Conference Finals, where, well, they got steamrolled by the Cavaliers. So I was right. One rookie auto and one old school auto. So that's the normal composition for uh, this product. Kelly Olinick. Not too bad because he has come into prominence in recent seasons with the Boston Celtics. So if they're able to keep Isaiah Thomas, make a few good additions, they might make the uh, playoffs again next season. I mean, they already exceeded all expectations by making it to the Eastern Conference Finals this year. Alright, uh, should be do one last memorabilia hit. So pretty, uh, I would say above average box. And this Cantor, uh, who was recently in Singapore. This is a Prestige Connection, Phoenix Suns, Goran Dragic, Kevin Johnson. Yeah. A little disappointing when it comes to uh, the insert set uh, in this product. 
cannot really stand out set right there expected more of a and of course the variety is also very limited I feel the base parts are all right the inserts not so much Sean Marion this pack feels pretty thick that's where you should have the uh, memorabilia hit I believe uh, MKG Michael Kidd Gilchrist enclosed game one material yet again a very boring single color patch navy blue from the uh, Bobcats so that should more or less uh, complete uh, the hits in this box no numbered cards at all I think I mean in subsequent prestige products like 13, uh, no, 14, 15 and 15, 16 I do remember getting a sizable number of uh, number cards I don't think they're listed at the back as well this is uh, Hardcore Heroes Dwayne Wade Isaiah Thomas alright last pack so overall um, well I won't say I'm extremely happy but not too disappointed either so there you go Kobe Chris Paul uh, Kendall Walker alright so that concludes uh, this box break so I'll see you next week uh, that is if I'm bringing in new boxes might want to try WWE or um, maybe have another go at Americana maybe have a shot at aficionado soccer but we'll see alright goodbye